Yo guys, we're out here at uh, Gallon House Bridge in Oregon. We're gonna do some fly fishing and crawdadding today, so uh, stay tuned for some good action. And uh, pull on your hats, you're in for a wild ride. fishing over there but there's a lot of crawdads so I'm gonna do some crawdad while they're fishing and uh, hopefully we'll have a good uh, big crawdad boil tonight Why don't you inform us what a, uh, a, a sculpin is and a periwinkle? Well, a periwinkle is a bug and a sculpin is a fish. What is the purpose of a periwinkle? What do they do and what do they eat? Well, I don't know what they eat, but they do make their own shells and they're really good for bait. Okay, what does a sculpin do? A sculpin swims around eating whatever's on the bottom. Oh, sweet. Yeah. You're a little biologist, aren't you? I guess. All right, here's the second trap. We're just using some sardines with oil, not water, oil. Just give her a little pop so the juices can seep out. Toss her in there, like so. Hey, watch it, man. It's been exactly 30 minutes. We're gonna pull these up. All right, guys. This has a new GoPro in it. Fresh battery, so we'll see what this catches. I just put a fresh one in there, fresh battery in this one, so that'll do good, and uh, put this down there too. Check that in, oh, I don't know, half hour. Our guy's pulling this up. Oh, whoa. We got one. Two. Yeah, we got one. It's a good one. Let's take a gander at him. Look at that. It's almost the size of my forearm, guys. Look at that. All right, so this is a little continued part of the video. Um, we're back at the Willamette, the last video we were at, that's the place we were at, and Chase is, uh, there's a whole school of smallmouth down there, they're not big, but he's going to try to get on a fly. That spot wasn't very good, we're going to, uh, we're going to take the next ferry across the river here in a few minutes, we're just going to wait for it, and uh, over there there's a really good hole, so we're going to wait a few minutes and uh, see you on the other side. All right, guys, we're exiting. Hooked up again on this hole. It's a really good hole. I don't know what it is. A little smaller, but uh, I'll take it. You know, any fish is good. Sorry guys, it's bright. 
Whoa, airborne. No way. What did you do? I don't know, I put the hook back through his uh How's that fight? Scale out of 1 to 10. I give it a 4.5. Switching spots. We were uh, over there. Okay. Alright. How's it feel? How's it feel? Pretty good. Pretty good? Yeah. Cool. A good one? A good one? Alright. Alright. I'm going to take the bag off for this. I'm going to help you land it. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah, nice that's one. a beaut. Yeah. Oh yeah. Whoa. Bring her in. Bring her in. Don't horse her. Don't horse her. Right. Good. We're good. We're good. All right. Bring her into the shallows over here. I can help you. Yeah. Nice one. All right. I'm gonna get in here. Here, I'm gonna get the sun behind you. Get that lighting on it. Choke nice. Oh, Another one. Airborne. So I'm gonna try to do this as humanely as I can. Oh, I just missed the eye. All right, guys. So, it's a good little fish. Um, how she feel? Ooh. Good yeah, that's a good one. That's a good one. I'll get in there. Stripes. Nice, so dude. Right in the corner of the mouth. Here, spin around. That's a good one. Yeah. It's dark. It's a dark fish, guys. Well, uh, as you can see, it's a very dark fish out here in the Willamette. Well, uh, Don't forget to, to subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe, guys! <laughs>